for being here. Thank you for playing Flinch with me, January. You were quite incredible at that. Maybe Thank our best you. ever player. I hustled you. You absolutely <laughs> did. That was a big hustle. Thank you're you. You're always great fun every time you're here. We spoke earlier. Last time you were here, you were you were here with BTS. Here's a photo of you here. What? Yeah. Are you a, are you a, January? Are you a fan of K-pop? I'm not. I had no idea who they were. You didn't know who they were. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I, I, I'm just not familiar with it. But I saw that they had like nine million security guards, so I was like, I better take, ask for a picture because <laughs> maybe they're running for president. I had no idea. Yeah. And so I asked for a photo, and then I put it on an Instagram. Oh. And then I got um, got some stuff. <laughs> I got, they they I sent got, you stuff? No. <laughs> What type of stuff? No, no, uh, you no, mean the BCS not, not army. The, there's um, a lot of fans that were like, hands off, lady. So, right. Yeah. <laughs> you I almost said are it. Clearly not on anyone. Yeah. No, I was nervous. There were so many of them. But, John, you are a legitimate, and this isn't a, you are a legitimate fan of BTS. You're so lucky. Yeah. To be... You're kidding. No, no. You're, you're so lucky to be in that picture. It's, uh... <laughs> I tried out to be their bodyguard and was cut. I didn't even make it. <laughs> No, I, I really, I'm a fan of BTS. You really are. What is it you love about? So, uh, I, oh, I became interested in the fact that, like, they're a Korean pop band, and they were the first Korean pop band to actually connect everybody throughout the world. They yeah. have fans throughout the world. So, I'm being in live entertainment. I was like, wow, that's interesting. How did they do this? And then I began to listen to their music and listen to the message they sent to their fans. And it's one of uh, self-love and self-reflection and being confident in yourself, even though you may be different. So not only are, is like the choreography and the development of personalities and the whole entertainment that they put on spectacular, young people are listening to their music and they're sending a good message through their music. And I think yeah. that's really cool. When you have popularity and you choose to use your voice for something good, I think that's a plus. That's I agree. Nice. I love them. I absolutely love them. Who's your, who's your fave? So... Who's your fave? Being an old-school rapper myself, RM and... RM. RM and J-Hope. RM. Both. Oh, I'm an RM and Jungkook guy. Uh. Yeah. I feel like me and you could make an, al an alternative K-pop <laughs> band. Like, we could, we could make No Way Pop. No Way Pop. No Way Pop. It would be K-pop and, and we love. No Way Pop. No Way Pop. Yeah. Me, you, who else would be in that band? I'll be in it. Yeah. No Way Pop. <laughs> me, I you. could do interpretive dance or something. Well, then, if you're doing that, we don't need any other members, because this, <laughs> this is done.